I think a boy dream of me is doing something with space. But unfortunately, space travel is not that sustainable, but maybe I can make it a bit more sustainable. What I like about innovation is that it really changes the world. An innovation is change. That's the definition of innovation. It can be small, it can be radical or large. That's what I really liked about innovation itself. And sustainability is not only about climate change or CO2 emissions, it's also about social sustainability. So how can we as humans interact with each other in a good manner? How can we integrate innovation into society, but at the same time keep it sustainable? How can we make a better world? That was really what was important to me. Sustainable innovation, you learn about how to understand, shape and evaluate innovations and technology from a societal, economic and long-term perspective. This knowledge, um, of course, uh, will be applied in sort of real-life situations like to our energy systems or how we use our mobility, but also in our built environment. You will learn about how to manage and govern innovations responsibly, and you will learn how and why it is important to think about societal implications of technology and innovation. The project I really liked was uh, my project about culture meat. It is meat that is grown in a lab, so without a cow. And we really analyzed what are the stakeholders involved with culture meat, uh, why isn't it popular yet, what should change to make it more popular or make it uh, grow in the future. One of the projects that was very interesting to me was uh, the inter-university course. A project where you are going to work with Utrecht and Wageningen University and are going to work on a new a neighborhood in, in a city that you have to make sustainable and you take a topic so we do uh, urban farming and uh, water retention systems and that felt really close to what you can do after your study and that was really awesome to me. I would see myself a little bit as a bridge between the technical and the social but that's also because that's what really interested me but you really have to find what you find interesting and also go for that when you start working. So my dream job, I think, would be in an advisory role for a municipality about environment. Because if I drive through Eindhoven right now on my bike, I'm frustrated <laughs> how many cars yes. and how little green areas we have. And it would be really cool to make it a more livable space. <laughs>